There's a prescription for happiness, a, a show being presented at the Garter Lane Theatre in Waterford on next Friday. And it's been delivered by a man called Dr Mark Rowe. And he started this show by giving sort of a lecture on well-being to people. And the lecture gradually got longer and longer and, and more comprehensive and, and it became a show. And, and it's because the, one of the failings he sees, he's a GP now, Dr Mark Rowe, GP, one of the failings he sees in modern healthcare is the culture of a pill for every ill, where people are allowed get ill and given what may be short-term sticking plaster solutions that do not examine or treat the cause, but just tackle the symptoms of their illness. And the shift, it seems to be, needs to be towards promoting wellness rather than belatedly tackling what is often avoidable illness. So it started as a lecture and then gradually went into a sort of a show. And he recommends, of course, amongst other things, that, that, that the seven, you should avoid the seven poison dwarfs in life. And the seven poison dwarfs are fear, envy, anger, anxiety, guilt, shame and sadness. They seem to me to correspond very closely to the seven deadly sins, which are pride, covetousness, lust, anger, gluttony, envy, and sloth. And I did that from memory. <laughs> I'm telling you, when you learn your catechism from the Christian brothers, by golly, you learn your catechism, I can tell you. So those are the seven poisons. And then the seven happy dwarfs are love, joy, hope, inspiration, interest, enthusiasm, and playfulness. Mm, I would have thought Forgiveness could have been in there somewhere because I think forgiveness is a very useful sort of thing. Anyway, he's, he's quoted as saying, and I just picked this up in the newspaper and giving it to you as I found it. I encourage people to look at the silver lining rather than the dark cloud and suggest new practices that they can incorporate into their daily lives. One example is keeping a gratitude diary. And either last thing at night or first thing in the morning, writing down two or three things you feel grateful for. This is a natural antidote to envy, hostility and negativity because it is impossible to feel grateful and hostile at the same time. And he is very, very keen on exercise. But by exercise he means walking, just walking. A, a prescription for walking regularly and reading and all of that. So there you are, that's Dr Mark Rowe and his show, which used to be a lecture, his show is called A Prescription for Happiness and it's at the Garter Lane Theatre in O'Connell Street in Waterford on next Friday. <laughs>